introducing the participants first. From Luzerne, Switzerland, weighing in at 232 pounds, Cesaro! My name is Enzo Amore, and I am a certified G and a bona fide star, and you can't teach that. Bada boom, realest guy in a room. How you doing? Whenever this superstar enters the arena, the atmosphere turns truly electric. Don't be surprised if your jaw hits the floor at any point during this one. These competitors are absolutely unbelievable. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to your main event, the Royal Rumble match. Man, oh man, how much do I love the Royal Rumble match. It's just, it's a very unique event, which is just only once a year, kind of like WrestleMania. Actually, exactly like WrestleMania. And it's just the most fun. You get to see a bunch of superstars beat the hell out of each other, looking to get the main event spot at WrestleMania. Look out, uh, Cesaro might be leaving this match up here tonight. Oh, it gets Enzo, but he doesn't. Now, ladies and gentlemen, hold on. We're about to have a countdown already. Oh, man, oh, man. I love it. Come on. Who's it going to be? Who's participant number three? Oh, man. Who is it? Oh, it's the big show. Oh, <laughs> dude. The big show has a lot of credibility. And, I mean, he proved it. At, 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 how old is this dude? At this, at what age did he win the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal? That's how insane this dude is. Hold on, wait. Enzo might be the first person to lead this Royal Rumble match. Oh man, oh man. One of the most, the most famous tag teams in NXT might be leaving here right now, right now. Oh, and he stays in. I don't know how, but he just manages to do it. We're about to have another countdown. Oh man. And the plus you got Cesaro, the former United States Champion, and Andre the Giant. Man, Memorial Battle Royal. Who's for number four now? Oh, man. Guys, Baron Corbin is no joke. He is one of the best superstars I've seen. He's a former NXT Tag Champion with NXT Prospect, The Savage. If you guys have seen him over the years, I hope so, because those two are deadly competitors, and together they're just absolutely amazing. The Big Show is how to... Oh, hold on, wait a minute. Big Show might be... Oh, heck no. You gotta be kidding me. Baron Corbin, he's going to the big man. If you're gonna make a statement here, you gotta make you gotta make it big. And the Big Show doesn't get any bigger than that. Oh, man. We're about to have another, another competitor, ladies and gentlemen. Number five on the way. Oh, man, oh, man. Remember, who's next? Who's... All right, all right. Not bad, not bad. We got Jimmy Uso, a former two-time tag champion with his brother, Jay. Oh, wait a minute. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Oh, Big Show. Man. You know, I haven't, I tried to get over to Big Show's uh, resume, but dang, man, there's a bunch of stuff happening here in the Royal Rumble. Let's see if I can do it real quick. All right, Big Show, multiple-time tech champion. Um, Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal winner. 
Uh, let's see, what else has he done? He's competed in numerous Money in the Bank and Royal Rumble matches. However, has not won either stipulation. Uh, he's won the United States Championship on numerous occasions. He won the Intercontinental Championship once in his career. Uh, he's held all the major titles of brands. Hold on, what about the new, new competitor right now? Hold on, who's going to be? Number six. <laughs> oh, wow. Talk about teamwork. You're about to get that early on in this matchup. Brother and brother going at it and helping each other out here in this Royal Rumble. If they get down to these two, you got to wonder who's going to turn on who first. Is it going to be Jay or is it going to be Jimmy? I won't be able to tell because they look the same to me. But yeah, Big Show has held the three major championships at the time on each branded uh, show. Which was uh, the WWE Championship, the World Heavyweight Championship, and the ECW Championship. This, the man has done it all. He's a future Hall of Famer. I say first ballet. Uh, uh, he retires tomorrow. He's going to the Hall of Fame the next time the Hall of Fame comes up, baby. And look at this. One of the Usos, I don't know which Uso it is, but he's looking to get rid of Cesaro right now. And the other Usos going straight out the Big Show. It's just illogical, though. Why are you going to go out there? Look at this. You just made a fool out of yourself. The Big Show's laughing at you. Oh, whoa. That dropkick really did it. And Enzo, man, I can't really tell you much here. It's just a bunch of chaos going around. But you know what? I got to tell you something here. If you're Jimmy, Jay, or even Enzo, you got to be excited because if you win this, your first major championship in WWE is going to be the WWE World Heavyweight Championship if you win this and main event in WrestleMania. That's just one of the best things. And these guys are tag competitors. Oh, man. And Big Show can take care of one of the users right now, but oh, he doesn't. But now, you know, if you're Cesaro and Baron Corbin and Big Show, you know, this you guys aren't really in a tag team competition that much. You already have experience as a singles competitor, and that's what gives you the edge over the rest of these superstars here. I say right now the best uh, superstar to win this matchup right now is probably the Big Show. I mean, he's won a battle, uh, Honor the Giant Memorial Battle Royal, which had 30 competitors in at the same time. That's far more complicated than the Royal Rumble. Instead of waiting for a countdown to hit and a superstar to come down, it, it, Big Show beat all 30 competitors, or excuse me, all 29 other competitors in the matchup with him. And that's what happened. And, and, and he just, uh, you know, that's, I think that's a little more impressive than the Royal Rumble. I think uh, Big Show's heavily favored to win this matchup here tonight. And Baron Corbin, you know, he's just absolutely phenomenal as well. Oh, and look how Big Show might be taking care of one of the Usos right now. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, man. He's hanging in there. Oh, and Cesaro tried to get rid of one of the Usos as well. Uh, which one is which? I just need to know. Okay, hold up. So, yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. I think Jay might be the one standing and the one laying down is Jimmy. I'm not sure. But Oh, look at this. Enzo looking to get rid of... Uh, Baron Corbin right now oh what did you guys did you see the strength the absolute phenomenal strength of Cesaro he just back body dropped the big show like he was a oh look at this look at this brothers are already fighting each other how amazing now you know if I if I had to basically rank who would be the favorite to oh and Enzo right away is done for man Baron Corbin Absolutely demolished him. Hold on, Baron Corbin's going after the Big Show now. Oh, amazing. Baron Corbin's already making a couple of statements. But like I was going to say before, though, how I'd rank this, uh, comp comp this matchup right now, if I had to choose between each of these five to win the matchup, I say it would go like this. It would go Big Show first, Cesaro second, and Baron Corbin third, and then Jimmy and Jey Uso are tied. They're, yeah, they're basically tied for... Uh, for last because the main thing is I basically go off of experience Big Show's won numerous countless singles titles in his career as Cesaro's only won like one and the Usos they have very little to no singles competition experience whatsoever and then again in the WWE uh, anything can happen here and the Big Show's taking his attention to one of the Usos. Uh -huh, we're about to have another competitor coming in here right now. All I want to know is who's it going to be. Number, uh, what, what do we want? Number seven? Let's see. Number seven. Who's it going to be? Oh, man. It is Heath Slater. Heath Slater is a pretty interesting competitor. He's a three-time tag team champion. 
in his own right. And that's more tag team championships than the Usos. I gotta give it to him. You know, Heath Slater's uh, had a pretty interesting career. And he's also uh, <clears throat> very interesting on the mic. He's got a couple of interesting things to say. And uh, here tonight, if he if <laughs> if Heath Slater wins the World Rumble, I think everybody's jaws are gonna be on the ground. And there goes one of the Usos. He's out of this Royal Rumble, man. He's already oh oh and what the hell? I need to, hold on. I need to get word from who? What Uso just eliminated the Big Show? Uh huh. Uh, okay. I just got word that Jay got eliminated and Jimmy is the one who eliminated the Big Show. How? F that's uh, what? That's tonight. Shocker. Shocker of the night goes to Jimmy Uso. Oh no! Whoa! 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 Forget about Jay. I mean Jimmy. He Slater just eliminated Baron Corbin. Man, these guys are eliminating the tags. The tag team competitors are eliminating the singles competition guys like their flies getting swatted. And he Slater, he's looking to make a statement. One foot out the door, and there he goes. He Slater just made back-to-back -back statements by eliminating both Baron Corbin and Cesaro. That is just absolutely astonishing in my eyes. What in the world? Next competitor, please come down. Oh, man. It's the New Days. Oh, there he is. Xavier Woods. Oh, man. Xavier, Xavier, man. That that dude right there is just absolutely uh, entertaining in his own right. And he's also a two-time tag champion. So look at all, look at all this. The, the Royal Rumble is being overflowed and crowded with tag team competition competition superstars I don't understand uh, my my top three players are uh, superstars I selected to be in the match of the longest possibly win the matchup or they're, they're all gone they got eliminated from tag team specialists oh man and Xavier look at the get rid of these Slater as the next competitor comes in oh wait 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 uh, is it gonna go is it gonna go oh wait a minute Zack Ryder's joining the the matchup okay now we got somebody a little expertise in both in ring tag team and singles competition and Zack Ryder going straight to Xavier Woods right away no if ands or buts about it man oh man this is absolutely phenomenal ladies and gentlemen I don't know what to tell y'all